hunting cat ever slept with a flock of birds or ate one for food or did his laundry and he ate the pants or bags. The lecture went on and on as usual. You've got to do something serious thinking before you leave this room, Mr. Pantry Cat, about what it means to be a cat. Not a bird, not a mouse, nor a grouse, not a moose, nor a goose, not a rat, or a bat. You need to think about just what it means to be a Siamese cat. He closed the bedroom door. Are you both? And stay out of but once he was alone, Skippy John Jones began to bounce and bounce and bounce on his big boy bed. Well, I'm Skippy John Jones, and I bounce on my bed, and one or six times, I land on my head. Oh. <laughs> on his way down to earth from a gigantic big bat, Skippy John Jones shot past his bedroom mirror. Oh, I got a bullet. What was that? So up he went again and again. It appeared... Then he used his very best Spanish accent. My ears are too big for my head. My head is too big for my body. I know if it's on Now he comes for us because we're awful and being stupid. 
Don Diego stood tall and spoke in his mo most somber voice. Yo, we for draw lots. Huh? <laughs> the dude just wants his beans back, and you're the dog for his job. <coughs> then all the chimichangas turned to Scapito, the great sword fighter. But poor Scapito had no time for a plan because, in the blink of an eye, a gigantic shadow darkened the landscape. The chimichangas scattered in all directions. Forget about that. 